like to welcome everyone. We will be talking about beauty and travel. My name is Edyta Satchel, and I have a guest speaker, uh, Gra Dr. Grażyna Pajunen. So um, our agenda for today, we'll talk a little bit about Satchel Global, the company I created, our clients' programs. We have a couple of testimonials. We will talk about travel on the plane, what to do, what not to do, contamination mm -hmm. zones. So I really hope you will find it interesting. Uh, we will talk a little bit about um, our beauty routine on the go, suggested. Of course, you guys uh, can do whatever you like, but I will be providing recommendations. And this is the first part of the first half of the of the session. And the second one, Dr. Grażyna Pajunen will be talking, telling us about aging. Why do we age um, and what to do uh, to avoid aging. I put you guys on mute, all of you, uh, so we can avoid the noise, just an FYI. Hey, Sue, I can see Sue. Good to see you, Sue. Okay, uh, who am I, what to do, why such a global? Uh, I've been traveling, I've been working in the travel industry for over 20 years. And on the call today, I have a friend of mine who've been traveling together with me. We traveled pretty much all the time. Um, there were situations for me personally where I was embarrassed by my red skin, irritated skin, oily skin. I didn't know what to do with this. Sometimes I had not enough makeup, sometimes, sometimes I had too much, or I sometimes didn't have any makeup at all because my skin was so red. Despite the fact that I've been loyal to various um, spa salons, beauty stores, I never received uh, the advice I should have received. So talking to various people, talking to different companies, I found that beauty professionals are actually not trained on how to support traveling consumers. Uh, talking to corporations, I learned that there is a huge need for travel wellness. They get a lot of uh, products or services around uh, fitness, um, diet, different things, what to eat, what not to eat, but there is nothing about travel wellness. So this is an introduction to that. And travel agents, as we know, in today's environment, they are looking for different revenue streams. Uh, last year, I conducted an intensive market research. I created five uh, large surveys. I reached out to six different beauty and travel blogger uh, groups. On average, um, 600 people responded to my surveys and over 3,000 people responded. I've learned a lot. This is just one slide uh, around a few uh, different things which, which I was told. Uh, based on the survey results, I actually created a white paper. I'm also getting ready to uh, write an ebook, but this is something that will come at the end of the year, closer to, closer to the end of the year, probably th the third quarter of the year based on my research, based on my own travel experience and so on. So what did, the, what did we learn? What did we find is that every, almost everyone is, is struggling. They don't, people don't know what to do when they travel, how to take care of themselves. They are looking for help, but they don't get a lot of advice when they travel, especially on long haul flights. Uh, the concerns that they have when they travel, for example, on vacation is that their skin will get oily. Um, it would be more impacted by the environment, by the, by the uh, air on the plane, the travel overall. It's, it's a stress for us, it's a stress for our skin. I want to briefly talk about three different groups of clients um, that I am working with. The first one is beauty professionals. Whether there are spa owners or beauty companies, I help them increase the retail a product saves by 300%. It's actually not that difficult uh, when we talk to them. Uh, on average today, mm -hmm. the revenue that they generate from selling beauty products is less than 10%, and it should be way more uh, than 10%. So they are always looking for ways how to uh, sell more and how to retain uh, clients and get more clients. I also um, started talking to travel agents. Travel agents are looking for additional revenue streams. Um, products and services which I uh, am offering, they will help them to do that. They will help them to add um, more value to their clients. Today, if clients cannot travel, they can uh, use certain products. They can take care of themselves 
uh, even you know prepare themselves for even when they are at home. The third group is frequent travelers, corporations. Uh, those are the travel wellness programs that I have. For um, travel, frequent travelers, I actually create beauty routines, beauty routine on the go, which I call them travel uh, beauty itineraries that are matching their uh, tra uh, travel itineraries. It's about using the right products based on their travel itinerary the destination they travel to and how to prepare themselves uh, before they travel to those destinations. And actually there is more. So my programs at a very, very high level, they are usually three to six months coaching programs. There is always a, a discovery call. I need to learn about who they are, what they do, their age, their, uh, you know, what they are looking for, whether it's a, uh, you know, individual traveling consumer or a spa owner, what do they need, what issues they have today, et cetera, et cetera. There is always a training online or in person, the training for, let's say, spa owner, travel agency, but also for their teams. Uh, I always provide training documentation to them so they can always refer back uh, to the materials, uh, marketing materials. This is something uh, they receive as well. Their profiles are, are featured on my website, such as global.com. Um, and to keep them, uh, when we work on the discovery calls, we create KPIs for the businesses. So we always do a checkup. I always do a monthly call with them to be able to measure the success of the program and if they are making a progress, because my job is to ensure that they do. They have, they received first-hand access to partners and events. Travel agents will, of course, get commission for selling products. And um, I also want to mention um, when I work, like I mentioned, when I work with individual travelers, uh, I created the beauty itinerary for them. But there are oftentimes I learned and I've seen, and actually I, I was asked to do um, groups of people. When they travel together, uh, there is a group of people traveling um, to India later this year. I was asked to create for them a program, beauty program, and present to them um, what to do, what not to do when they travel. So it's an hour, usually an hour presentation. Prior to that presentation, I would uh, conduct a short survey where I would ask, without disclosing any names, I don't care about names, I care about you know, their age, the areas where they live today, because someone, if someone lives in Arizona versus uh, someone uh, living in uh, you know, Washington DC area, they have different beauty needs and uh, they react differently to, um, to different uh, climates, temperatures and so on. Uh, I always ask about their where do they travel, so they will do uh, provide this information. Also, beauty concerns or skin concerns. People may have rosaria. People may have other, you know, problems with uh, oh, with the skin, and they want to. Uh, I want to address those things too. So not only that on those individual uh, advice that I provide to them, but also the groups. I also provide them with information of as a remind reminder. Don't forget your passport. Don't forget about such thing which is called real ID. Uh, don't forget about your visa if we need to do it. But on those group calls, I also invite a medical doctor and who can address things like um, vaccination. So this is what I'm doing for the trip to India, where I will have a medical doctor also talking about the vaccination, how to prepare themselves and why the vaccination, for example, is important. So. This is really high level. I have really a whole presentation for each of those programs when, when I present to those groups and uh, different people. So I just want to uh, do it at a very high level. I want to uh, talk uh, uh, about a couple of testimonials that I received. This, she is a flight attendant. She works for one of the top international airlines and uh, she spends all the time on the plane and her skin was, um, dry, irritated, red, similar things like I have, but she started using the products I recommended to her. One of the things she's using, and I will show you, and this is something that uh, Dr. Payunen will be talking about it today, is actually some of those products, Biosol products, so this is one of it. What I recommended to her, and this is what I used to uh, myself too, this product, instead of taking such a big bottle with them on the plane, okay, 
there are small, either small sachets. So again, I'm just showing it to you, but uh, more of that will be discussed later on. Or even little, like looks like a candy. So that's what I take uh, when I travel. All the details, again, we'll learn later, uh, you know, this uh, at the presentation. But this is what she started to use and she noticed a huge significant difference. Um, Another one is Shine. Shine is actually her stylist. She has her salon. I've been working with her for the last six months. In the first two months, she noticed the increase in the retail product sales. What happened? She actually started engaging every single client in that so-called upcoming travel conversation. This comes really naturally. I taught her um, what to say, how to say it. There are many of us who travel. And I will give you an example. When I go to a, a spa or when I go to a, a store, beauty store, when I want to buy a product, every, everybody looks at me and they say, oh, you have an oily skin. This is correct. Uh, I have an oily skin. My skin is shiny pretty much all the time. So all, all they do is recommend a product for me to use for now, for right now. When I uh, offer uh, a piece of information such as, hey, next week I'm traveling, let's say, to India. They just don't know what to do with this information. But all of them should be telling me, oh, did you know that because you are traveling to India, you should start taking care of your skin, of your hair now? And then during your travel on the plane and also in destination, and your routine will be totally different. The products you need to use are different because even when we think about that, the skin product which I use today to get rid of that oily uh, skin, the job of that product is to make my skin drier. When I go to India with the dry climate, um, my skin will become even more dry. So I cannot use products which, uh, you know, job is to make my skin dry. I need to, a product that will moist uh, moist my skin so many times i've heard those stories that people simply went to different vacations they just didn't have products uh, to use and they were afraid to buy products because they didn't speak the language they didn't understand they didn't know what was on the cover of the you know beauty product container and so on another thing is what i heard many times from the hairstylist is um, they always sometimes actually they forget to tell their clients do not have your hair dyed a day or two before your travel. What happened to one of my uh, ladies I'm working with, she told me she went, uh, she has long blonde hair. She went on a business trip to, uh, to the Caribbean, to Mexico. And the day she arrived, as we know, beautiful weather, she started, she went to the pool. What happened? Her blonde hair um, became green. What she did, she went to scream, at the manager of the hotel, <laughs> luckily at the, at the uh, group of people who traveled with her, there was a hairstylist who said, oh, no, 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 that's a normal thing that happens. You probably just had your hair uh, dyed. And she was, yes, that's exactly what happened. And she didn't even know. So can you imagine this kind of disaster when you go to a trip, business trip, and you have to entertain clients and travel with your boss, manager, and, uh, you know, colleagues, work colleagues, prospects, and God knows who else. So really, truly, this is something we need to know. So let's talk about, I have a couple of slides about what's happening on the plane when we travel. So let's take a look at the contamination zone on the plane. Everything what's in front of us, it's actually, actually number one and two. So everything what's in front of us, trays, I always wipe them. So I recommend that you guys take, remember to take like the way uh, wet um, wipes with you. Everything was behind us, which is bathroom, right? Behind us, usually it's, all of the stuff is behind us. Toilet, uh, water faucets, uh, paper towel dispensers. This is number as we see three, four, five, six. Anything was above us, which is the AC knobs in the ceiling. This is another contamination zone that we should wipe. I was traveling uh, from Orlando a couple of weeks ago over the weekend, and there was a gentleman who I saw him when I entered the plane, he was wiping off his seat. Turned out he was sitting in my seat. So I took advantage of it. I, and of course I thanked him for the fact that he cleaned my seat and he did the same <laughs> again for his entire thing, you know, so for his seat. So I was actually, actually lucky in this way. 
So, and we know that the blankets and pillows are not always um, cleaned uh, the way it should be. Okay, another thing, things that happen to our skin when we fly. So what's happening to, uh, to our skin? Um, on the plane, lack of proper humidity. Um, the humidity on the plane is usually under 20%, which is not enough. The, the norm is 60, 70, 80%, it depends. But 20 is way uh, uh, too little. What causes, this causes major dryness, flaky skin, nosebleed. This used to happen to me, nosebleed. It was actually quite frequent. What else? Planes create artificial pressure. Again, we have a problem with reduced blood flow. Our skin doesn't look glowy, uh, doesn't look fresh. And this is one of the reasons why. What else? Um, we are closer to the sun. And I don't know, sometimes we don't realize it. But really, this lady here on the plane, it's me. Because I love to sit by the window and I always do it. So I always, uh, when I buy a cream, a face cream, I always buy it with the sunscreen. I always, I always apply it. For some pe people, it may come as a surprise uh, that dry air makes our skin sometimes more oily. And many times, and I didn't know initially, uh, you know, a, a way back, why when people leave the plane, when they get off the plane, why their skin is shiny? It's actually because the skin is trying to compensate to mm -hmm. produce, you know, the dryness to produce more moist, which becomes, because of that, the skin becomes more uh, um, not glowy, <laughs> actually more, more oily. And it's lack of moist, lack of uh, hydration. We know that drinking water is not uh, enough when we fly. Um, so those products that Dr. Uh, Grajena will be telling us today should be talking about that uh, hydration as well. The last thing, salty snacks. I know we like to snack. This is not really recommended. It causes bloating. Um, it happened to me i used to get stomach cramps and i never knew why and then i you know when i learned all the stuff it was like oh my goodness now i know what it is alcohol for those of us who love to have a glass of wine or a i don't know cocktail this is a big no-no uh, for our skin it's, it's really dam damaging thing if i can you know recommend if we have a flight if we take a flight and we have um a stopover between flights this is when we Wine, or um, this is when you can have, you know, a, a drink, but not on the plane. And this is any type of alcohol. Our skin becomes red. People with rosaria, their skin will, like I said, mentioned before, their skin will become even more red and irritated. Uh, so hugely not recommended. Oh, I wanted to share a couple of things, which that may not look nice to some of you, but. Really, truly, this is, this is what happens to me. What you see on the right-hand side, this is a cotton pad. This is totally white, clean. This is just one, uh, um, my, I wiped my face after one day of doing whatever I normally do. I go to work, I, I go to a conference or whatever I do. This is actually, this dirty one is a travel on the plane. So this is something, uh, look how different it is. One day of doing whatever I normally do, and this is just a few hours spent on the, on the plane, how filthy it is. Um, one recommendation which I, can, uh, I want to also suggest is the closest, when we select our seats, right? When we buy our seats, the closest to the front of the plane, the closer to the front of the plane, the better, why? Because we on the plane, we do not get fresh air at all. It would be way too expensive for the airline to heat the fresh air every time because we up in the air, the, the, cold, you know, the air is very, very cold. So what's happening is the fresh air is only uh, uh, pushed for the captain the, uh, uh, at the front of the um, a plane, at the cockpit. So people, passengers in the front of the plane, they get a little bit of that fresher uh, as well. So I really, if when you, when you have a dilemma where to uh, select your uh, seat, I always recommend to do it on the front as close as possible. I used to myself travel almost in the bathroom at the very, very 
end uh, of the plane uh, at the back because I just didn't want people to walk next to me. Oh, I'm not doing that anymore. I'm trying as much as close as I can to the front of the, of the plane. And there is one more test that I've conducted, I've been doing, and this is the stuff that I will be using in my um, ebook, <clears throat> is how oily is my skin? And this is real case scenario. When I got on the plane, so we can see what's happening on the plane, how it's becoming drier. This is uh, hour zero. This is after one hour. So you see it's less. And this is after two hours. So you see even uh, a drier, drier, drier. So that's what you can see. Um, my suggested beauty routine for all of us who are traveling. So what do I do? A day before I travel, I put a mask. 20 minutes, whatever mask it is, whether it's cream, whether it's face mask, that's how I am preparing my skin, my face for the trip. The day when I travel on the, uh, on the plane, the day of my travel, it depends. What you can see, this is me sitting on a plane wearing a mask, which is a sheet mask. When this was a four hour flight and I put this mask, usually I usually do it in the middle of the trip. If you travel, let's say internationally or overnight, you would, I would recommend you do it when you wake up, when you go to, when you sleep, fall asleep, when you wake up, this is what you would refresh. This is when you will moist, uh, moist, moist, moisturize your um, face. Um, for those of us who don't like to look like me on the plane with those, you know, under eye patches, those masks, I would recommend an extra layer of cream before you get on the plane or a serum. So I have a serum and Dr. Grażyna will be telling us about, this is one of the serums of the products that she is, um, I, don't, I cannot, I don't know if you guys can see it, but this is, she will be talking about this whole uh, line of products as well. But this is something I use uh, a couple of drops um, and I, you know, the, the face looks totally different. This is, you know, really, really good. Oh my goodness, what a, what a really huge difference when I do that. So this is when, I, when I'm um, on the plane. When I arrive in destination, I wipe it, I clean my face, and I do put a um, serum again for that skin to get, again, glowy, fresh. Um, when I come back from my travel, again, another mask, those really work very well, another serum, every single time because you will notice the difference, especially, uh, like I said, it's a stress for us when we travel, but it's a, also a stress for our skin. I have a couple of pictures and some of us may recognize uh, this lady in particular, in particular, her name is Lisa. She allowed me to share this picture. She was traveling with me. So I um, recorded her uh, she recorded me, I recorded her. So she followed my steps and uh, she was um, using the same um, uh, beauty routine as I did. So you can see she's wiping, she's cleaning her face, uh, her face first. On a flight, which is let's like three, four hour flight, I wouldn't uh, clean my, um, I, I wouldn't remove my eye makeup. I would just leave it there because all I do is just the area around it. So outside. She's this lady on the left, she's a flight attendant. So I started talking to her, I gave her advice. She uh, travels, this is a long haul international flight where she has a break. So one of those, she, she's not using this eye patches, but this is one of eye patches that I use. So that's what you see. I also use things like that, which is the lips. Okay, so this is, she's using, I actually even gave it to her. So she's using that lip. Um, mask, um, mask sheet, you see a pillow, she is resting because on those long haul flights they have, I don't know, a couple of hours of rest. They can do nothing, rest, relax, uh, fall asleep if, if they want to. So uh, she gave me, she really likes it. She really likes the, the beauty routine I recommended and she, she was very happy. Okay, you know, my part of the presentation comes to an end. What I would like to ask you, ask you guys is, like us on social media, everything what I have is on such a uh, global, it's always the same, Twitter, uh, Facebook, and so on. Let your beauty professionals know and travel advisors know about this kind of programs. Let your frequently traveling friends know about the program um, and that we are helping them to look beautiful before, during, and after travel. Um, 
there is on my website the products that Grażyna will be showing us. They, we, anybody can register, can purchase them. Um, there is also, I want to mention, because we had a few other presentations in the past uh, we did uh, together, I always forgot to mention that actually there is an opportunity to make money when, when those products are being uh, sold. So, um, so travel agents can do it, uh, all of us can do it pretty much, doesn't have to be a travel agent or anybody else, but all of us can get money if they sign up for so-called business programs. I just want to give you a heads up. Um, I will be presenting in June at this conference, International Aesthetics, Cosmetics and, and Spa Conference. I don't know what happened here. Um, and um, which is in Vegas. I have a two hour session when I will be presenting to spa owners uh, and telling them, educating, teaching them on um, how to um, increase retail product sales, overall sales by tapping into traveling consumers, how to have a conversation with them similar uh, to what we did with Chine, um, so uh, to help them grow their business. And there is another conference uh, of the same type, but in New York City in August. So uh, as you can see here, uh, Dr. Grażyna Payune will be presenting, I will be there as well. So we'll have an opportunity to, to talk to clients, uh, prospects over there. Dr. Grażyna has been presenting to actually a lot of different events and conferences, and she received a lot of uh, amazing feedback and people basically love her products. So if spa owners love her products, I'm telling you, this is, this is really good. Um, Grażyna, you ready? Yes, of course. Thank you so Excellent. much. Okay, so <laughs> let's move to your part. Let me then, uh, I need to stop sharing, right? That. And I need to start sharing. Okay, there you go. Okay. Now, uh, let me share. Let's see. Yes, we can see you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Now I think, um, can you see? Yes, we can. Okay. So just uh, thank you so much, Edita, for inviting me. And uh, I am so excited about um, this presentation because um, I'm actually a PhD in electrical engineering, but I have been um, doing research in biomedical field for over 25 years. And this is my passion, uh, doing research and finding uh, something which is uh, total, which can help us to feel better. And this, um, so everything I just want to tell you, everything what I'm going to say, I can prove. Everything what I'm going to say is scientific, scientifically proven and it's clinically proven. So that is very important because a lot of stuff that people are writing or sharing on the internet is actually not true. So this is very important. So with that, I want to tell you about the products that Edita was um, telling a little bit about um, and uh, why I, was even, I am even interested in them. Um, here is my husband in uh, 2012. Uh, he had a terrible tr problem with his shoulder. He could not lift his right arm without the help of the left arm. Even to drive a car, he needed to just to move the hand. Um, and that discomfort became so bad that he was not able to sleep at night. And finally, he went to the doctors. And once they um, checked him, he, they said that, it's too damaged for surgery, that the only possibility at this point is a total reversion replacement. And because he loves the sport and he loves water skiing, obviously, uh, if, if he uh, agreed to join replacement, he would not be able to do it. So he didn't agree. So um, fortunately, we had a neighbor, uh, Elizabeth, and Elizabeth uh, was born with arthritis. Uh, Elizabeth, uh, her family was trying to do everything to stop that illness. Um, they had money, so money was not an issue, and they couldn't. So uh, she already had both his hips replaced, 
and she was on a wheelchair waiting for the new replacement where her massage therapist actually told her about, uh, told her about this product. And because it is 100% natural, she said, okay, I try it. I don't believe it's going to work. Well, in several months, she doesn't know exactly how many, but she felt so much relief that she never replaced her knees and she's today walking normally, going to gym and even teaches yoga. So she came to my husband and said, listen, you need to get it because this is the only thing that helps me. My husband is very skeptical, but he had no choice. He said, okay, give it to me. <laughs> it's not going to work. Well, the first month it did not work. So you can, uh, you can understand what I have heard at home. You see, I told you, they cheat me. <laughs> the second month, and this is very important, the second month, actually, the pain increased drastically for about a week or a week and a half. And the third month, suddenly, when he was already almost losing hope, he called me to the kitchen and he said, look, I took the milk out of the refrigerator. Today, he's doing 20 chin-ups, push-ups, and water skis on a professional level. And he tells me that he has basically brand new shoulder. So he told me, you are a scientist, so please check it out, why this works, and we have obligation to share it with people. So that's exactly what I did. And as I said at the beginning, I don't believe just um, what anybody writes on the internet. I believe in scientific uh, journals, I believe in referee journals. So I checked, and this uh, has 37 clinical studies, seven US international patents, and I studied it, and the more I studied it, the more I was amazed. And I noticed that this is the only product that actually can rebuild connective tissue, can rebuild synovial fluid in your joints. And that is so important because the joints do not have the uh, blood supply anymore. So, uh, so the only way the nutrients can get to the joints is through the synovial fluid. But if the synovial fluid dies, dries out, then there is no way to get nutrients to your joints. So it can rebuild it. And also as a side effect, it rebuilds, rebuilds your skin. So I was shocked. So let's first concentrate on what happens when we age. Um, and um, this one uh, is a whole list. But I just tell you, you can read it. But what is really important is that everything happens on a cellular level. Our cells are replaced in our body. So if we give our body the building material, so to speak, that the body can rebuild itself, it will. But our food today is, is, does not have those things that we need. So that is the reason why we have even the younger people today starting developing certain, a lot of problems. So this is, um, this is basically um, what we need to pay attention to, how to rebuild our body on a cellular level. So this is <laughs> the most important slide from the whole my presentation. So if you understand the slide, you will understand what's going on. So connective tissue, which of course you understand, all body is built basically from connective tissue, is, is 90% of connective tissue is built of three components, and that is collagen, hyaluronic acid, and chondroitin sulfate. So the two of those components are here on that slide. Um, this blue one is the level of the collagen in our body. And um, this is the age, right? So when you see, when we are born, 
we have very little collagen because the body is small. And then we get more and more until we stop growing. When we stop growing, we stop losing the collagen and about 15% every 10 years. Well, this is another curve, which is hyaluronic acid. So hyaluronic acid is that what is synovial fluid in your joints. That's what in your skin. That every, um, if you drink water and you do not have hyaluronic acid, you will not hydrate your body. And look what happens. That drops from the moment that we are born. How quickly it drops, that's the key. Uh, the more stress we have, the more, um, the, the worse food we have, the more chemicals we have around us, the more radiation, the faster is that dropping. So we are basically drying out. And that is the aging process. So if you know some islands or some villages in Japan where people live for over 100 and they do not have problems with their joints, they have beautiful skin and no wrinkles, what happens? Well, that what happens that these levels are not going down so quickly with age, they, were, they are able through their lifestyle to hold on to hyaluronic acid and also collagen. So the question for us is, well, we cannot change much of our environment, right? Because that's, we can control what we eat, obviously, we can control what we drink, but we, we have this, um, environment full of chemicals and, and so on. So the only thing would be how to replenish it, how to lift those errors up. So that's what we really would like to do. And um, so the company in California, they fortunately, they found out the natural ingredient that is comprised of those three components that our connective tissue is built of. That means liquid collagen, hyaluronic acid, and chondroitin sulfate. And what is really amazing that those, these uh, components are in exactly the same proportions as our body is built of. So what it means for us, it means that our body, which is losing it, and they, the body is trying to regenerate, but it cannot because it doesn't have that material. It says, yes, please give it to me. I'm losing it. When we drink this, the body gets exactly what it is losing. So it is not a foreign substance that we are entering, giving our body. It's actually the thing that we are built of. So our body recognizes it as its own substance, okay? And what happens is those proportions are so important. Think about this. Um, if you have a key, if you have exactly correct cut on the key, then you can open the lock. But if the cut is not correct, then you cannot. So there are a lot of companies that are trying to imitate that. They do the mixture. They try to get, and it's not going to work. Here, we can't correct nature. This is nature. Nature said, this is what your body is built of. Give it back to your body, and your body will say thank you. Now, let me also tell you why this is so important. Collagen is like a brick in the house. Hyaluronic acid is like a mortal connecting the bricks, correct? Okay, now we are losing it. Bricks and mortal, 15% every 10 years. What happens to your house? Well, the same happens to your body. So you cannot rebuild, you know, when, when you're losing bricks and, and mortal in the house, you cannot just paint it. You cannot just buy new furniture to make it better. 
you have to bring those materials back and start to rebuild it. And that's exactly what happens. If you give the body what it needs, the body will rebuild itself. Here you see, here is bone, another bone, here is the collagen, this is the synovial fluid, separate those bones, and this is the cartridge which covers the bones, okay? Once we lose synovial fluid, then you have bone on bone and the cartridge is being destroyed. So once you drink this, first thing what happens, we are rebuilding synovial fluid that separates the joints and then the cartridge cells start to duplicate itself and start rebuilding. If you decide to go for joint replacement, when what happens? The surgeon will cut, oh sorry, will cut the here, and then these bones are dying. And then they put metal or whatever the artificial joints here. Now, after a few years, these bones are, are dead, so everything starts moving. So you have to, even if, if the surgery goes fine, there is a lot of complications even with this, but let's assume it's fine. So then they have to cut more in the second surgery. Take it out, put it back. So anyhow, we try to avoid it. So we try to rebuild this uh, joint. Um, this is another thing which is very important. It's to show you this is the, how you, our connective tissue is built. And this is how the new generation of collagen is built. If you check this and this proportions, you will see that it's one to one. That is very, very important. Now, here is the um, dermatologist, since we are talking about the skin, um, that uh, a lot of serums and creams, they have hyaluronic acid. They don't work. They do not work. You spend money on something that doesn't work. Why? Because in nature, the molecule of hyaluronic acid is too large to be absorbed in the skin. So when the doctor will inject you the hyaluronic acid in your joint, try to replenish some of your fluid, or if you get injections in your skin of hyaluronic acid, that's always a filler. It will not rebuild your joints. It will be working as a filler. So the, one of the biggest discovery of this century, according to my opinion, in the anti-aging industry is this picture. This company, after 20 years of research with uh, scientists from universities such as Harvard and uh, Stanford, Cornell, they finally broke a code. And this is the very first product on the market that has optimized size of the molecule of hyaluronic acid and at the same, co same collagen. So actually it is one molecule, again, that consists of those three components in 90% with optimized size of the molecule. So it is going through the skin, it is going to, so in your body to replenish anywhere you need it. So it works globally. It doesn't work on one joint but, or one skin or anything, but it works globally. And this is one of the most important uh, slides also. It shows that you have increased uh, drinking 15 milliliters in the morning and 15 milliliters at night consistently for 28 days you increase hyaluronic acid in your bloodstream 6,000% or 60 times. Normally, even if you manage to increase 1%, that was a lot. We increased 60%, 6,000%. That's amazing. And this is another uh, thing that if you have, many people take collagens like powders, mix it, uh, or pills, and this is terrible because, and this is uh, from Italy dermatologist, Italian dermatologist, uh, and he says that hyaluronic acid is a sugar, collagen is a protein, and they are destroyed in GI tract. So what that means is that if, if you have to digest it, 
then it will be disassembled into amino acids and it will be the best is removing it from your body. But really, it will even feed your bacteria and viruses. So this is really very bad for you. So, so this is really no. This is another slide, uh, which is very, very important. We have an enzyme called hyaluronidase in our body. That enzyme kills hyaluronic acid. So this enzyme helps us to age. <laughs> so, and that is, we want that enzyme to be as weak as possible. And this enzyme is that stronger if you have more stress. If you travel a lot, <laughs> you have it even stronger. If you, um, if you uh, have uh, not so good nutrition, if you don't exercise and so on and so on, your lifestyle. So this uh, actually, um, this product, if you just drink it regularly, then it almost disactivates over 80% of this uh, hyaluronidase. So from one point of view, it disactivates hyaluronidase. From the other point of view, it rebuilds hyaluronic acid in your body. That is the reason why we have all those results. We have 37 clinical studies, but the, this one I, I still show you. Um, it, you know, in two months, if you take it regularly, 90% uh, of people had 40% improvement in joint discomfort. And this is dryness of the skin. So again, in three months, you know, you can uh, lower the dryness of the skin almost 80% without using any topical moisturizers. So that's amazing. So what do we need to do? We need to take good care of your body, eat well, good quality food, eat less, a, li a little exercise, and optimal supplementation because today's food unfortunately is not going to give us correct uh, supplementation so correct nutrients so uh, i consider that to be the best because number one it is scientifically tested effectiveness number two is a naturally occurring matrix not collagen but the matrix of hyaluronic acid, chondroitin sulfate, and, and collagen in highly observable form. It is absorbable in any way from 95 to 98%. And it is manufactured exclusively in United States in facilities that are certified by the government agencies. So it was created for joints and people were taking for joints and I was talking about joints, but People were taking for joints and their friends said, did you, did you have your facelift? What happened to you? You look so good. Well, then the company started studying it because in, in the bio cell, we had collagen number two. And for the skin, we need collagen one and three. So what happened? They actually find out that it activates also collagen one and three. So it activates all three collagens, one, two, and three. That's why it's not only rebuilding your skin, but also your eyes, your gums, your hair, your nails, and obviously your connective tissue. So here it is your skin. So you look, this is a beautiful skin, this is collagen, and this is hyaluronic acid here. When it's young skin, everything is in order, right? Here, as you see here, one collagen is missing. So it causes wrinkle. So now, if we were able to, to get it back, this collagen here, so this is the problem that normally we can't get there because the skin is too tight. Well, here, because they optimize the molecules, we are able to do it from inside and from outside. And once we get back that collagen and hyaluronic acid, that smooth those wrinkles. And I will show you clinical studies very soon. But first, let's look at some results. So here it is, look at her neck. 
This is after three months on the product. And we had tons of clinical studies, as I said, we had many awards. So I just mentioned two. In 2011, they took all the products, including medication for bones and joints, and they gave the, the first prize for liquid biocell. And then in um, 2015, in Geneva, in Europe, they evaluated the supplements, uh, the word supplements, and they chose liquid biocell as a number one supplement uh, in nutrition, okay, Supple nutritional supplementation. So, sum it up, what is unique? Well, this is, a, this is a supplement, so it's natural product. It has 37 clinical studies and seven US and international patents, very unique for the supplements. It's, uh, it's actually the company that manufactures it, it has, it has a license to manufacture pharmaceuticals, but they don't do it. They do so supplements on the standard of pharmaceuticals, okay? That's important also. It's made from a single natural source that mirrors the joint natural composition. It utilizes the patented bio-optimized process, which ensures a rapid absorption as I said, 95 to 98%. It switches hyaluronidase, normally it doesn't do it, nothing, that, and that kills hydronic acid. Okay, so we, we preserve it. It helps to rebuild connective tissue, our joints and our skin. It's manufactured exclusively in the United States, and it is in a liquid form. That's very, very important. Comparison with other uh, collagen products on the market, very quickly, three types. Number one, which is uh, unhydrolyzed. So if it's unhydrolyzed, you are talking about the molecule is too large for the absorption. 300 is not going to go through 1.5. So it's not going to work. We don't need to worry about it. Hydrolyzed. This is the bovine type. Uh, which is, uh, uh, you know, from a pig or, or cow. First of all, it has type 1, collagen not type 2, so it's not going to work for joints. And also, it doesn't have hyaluronic acid on chondroitin sulfate, so it's not going to rebuild your, uh, neither your skin, neither your joints. So maybe it can help a little bit on the surface of your skin, but that's about it. And then finally from the fish, so-called marine uh, collagen. Again, it's type one collagen has not correct. Um, they have all three, but in a very wrong proportions and in much, uh, not in a good, uh, you know, very little of the hyaluronic acid and chondroitin sulfate. So you see it here. And, um, and also, so it can help a little bit for the pain and stiffness, but it, again, it's not going to rebuild neither your uh, skin, neither your joints. We have four types, um, but I don't want to go all of, uh, for all of them. They differ because they have different uh, uh, additions. They have the same amount of biocell in all of them, but they have different additions. So, Life has uh, 13 superfruits, which are amazing, amazing for um, uh, immune system, for, um, uh, um, uh, for a, uh, to, to kill uh, free radicals, and also to uh, uh, anti-inflammatory benefits. And also it has uh, resveratrol. Resveratrol, it's transresveratrol, which is the highest grade resveratrol. And what it does is um, it's very good for cardiovascular system and also a very, very strong antioxidant. And also it activates SIRT1, which is the gene that uh, is uh, called beauty gene, which we lose with age. And normally to activate that, we needed. Uh, uh, calorie restriction or starvation. Well, 
this trans resveratrol can activate it. So this is a powerhouse. This is absolutely powerhouse. Skin and sport does, don't have resveratrol. It had different uh, additions for um, sport, for muscles, for focus, for, um, for you can uh, uh, harder exercise and quicker regenerate. And also skin is additional stuff for your skin. So it, they are all working also for joints. So they are phenomenal. And these uh, also can work, can help you with other stuff such as kidneys or, um, or um, liver or so. So we can talk more about it. I don't want to spend more time on it because uh, I want to talk about trim. Trim is um, an, another amazing thing. It has half a dose of biocell, what we were talking about, but also it has clarinol, CLA, um, which reduces the amount of body fat and increases the lean body mass, which is, means that rebuilds your muscles. So it improves body composition. And this is especially important because it removes fat around your internal organs and that's very very important and also have the detoxification process and so on and this one uh, is the fat ar around internal organs is much more dangerous than the outside fat because it's actually a killer and this is uh, just very quick uh, i found also on the web mat that cla also is cancer prevention and prevents hardening of the arteries so it's amazing it's combination of this thing that rebuilds your body rebuilds your connective tissue and at the same time removes the body fat and remove and rebuilds your muscles and here are some um, clinical studies especially it removes fat uh, from legs and from your trunk. And here is the realistic expectations that it will take at least three months to six months to really, really see your results. So this is very important that you understand that it is not a one day thing. We are rebuilding the body on a cellular level. And also we can have the whole system if somebody wants to really focusing on the is, uh, of the shaping the body we have the whole system we also follow the routine drink a lot of water don't drink the sugar drink cut fried foods cut sweets and walk, at least walk and as far as the diet the best what i found is a mediterranean diet but everybody has their own ideas about it but medical journals will confirm mediterranean diet brings the best results as far as the medical community is concerned even if you want to lose uh, weight and finally this is the serum what um, edita was talking about i carry the serum everywhere i carry it in my purse when i travel because this is the only serum that has that hyaluronic acid that actually will penetrate through the dermis of your skin and rebuilds your skin. And when you travel and when it's dry, dry air, you really feel it that your skin needs hydration. So when you put few drops, I actually put two of those droppers uh, on my face and uh, it is feeling is phenomenal and you can connect collect connect it with the skin uh, with a drink so you build it from inside out and from outside in and here are the clinical studies about the this clinical grade uh, col uh, this collagen matrix um, by yourself so you see in eight weeks you have increased no needles no surgery nothing just serum 31.7 percent and removing deep lines 38.5 percent and so on so these are amazing amazing results and we have tremendous uh, that i will show you how to get it but this is a deal this is phenomenal deal 50 percent discount on three creams and two drinks <laughs> you can choose your drink you can have life you can have sport you can have skin whichever you want but uh, I don't suggest pure. Pure is because 
you want to rebuild your immune system and through those fruits and those additions, you really do that. So pure is only for people who have allergies for, in some, for some fruits or something. Other than that, I would recommend the something that has those addition fruits because they, everything works in synergy and in even helps the uh, work of your bio self. So this is very quickly, uh, we have no time. So this one is a mask which will uh, uh, give oxygen back to your skin. It, uh, you use it uh, the first week for every day and then you use it like two, three times a week. Then this is your serum uh, I talk about, and this is the moisturizer, which also have this bio cell. And all three are amazing. You will see results almost immediately uh, with this. Look one week on that uh, bio cell, the neck. This is three months. This is three months, three months. That lady, she was so shocked when she got her results. Amazingly, three months. This is three months also. Look at the quality of the skin. That's what I would ask you to do. Take a picture of your skin, even if you use it for joints. Take a picture of your skin and zoom it because you will be shocked with your results. Look at this hair. That's amazing. And look, this is an 82 years old lady. She had a, a age spots and she put the serum for two months on only one arm. Look the results. Do you see it? It's absolutely amazing. This is this lady, the Tara, 82 years old. They took her one and a half year. One and a half year. Is it worth it? I mean, that's another lady, right? So um, that's, this results are absolutely amazing. I am sorry that I didn't take a picture of me because I have changed a lot as well. But that's why I suggest everybody take a picture. <laughs> and this one, the last one is a dog. Why I want to show you a dog? Because some people say, oh, this is a placebo. You know, you just think that you can change, so you change. Well, look at this dog. Um, on the right, the dog, is, on the left is the dog before by yourself. And on the right is 11 weeks after he, uh, he, he took by yourself. Look at that. Poor doggy. Do you know some people who can, cannot walk the stairs? Well, they could run like this later. <laughs> we know several. I, I could give you examples after example after example. Look again with the, with the dog on the right. You see it? That's absolutely amazing. So thank you so much for your attention. And now I would like uh, Edita, if you could um, show how to, how to get it or if anybody has any questions, of course I stay here and I can answer any questions you might have. Thank you so much for your attention. Thank you, Grazina, very much. I really appreciate that.